Hello, everyone, and welcome to Aquarian Radio at AquarianRadio.com. I'm your host, Jenna Kier Lesson, with my incredible co-host, Dr. Sasha Lesson. And today we have a very special show with Paula Harris. And Paula, the Fizi Harris is an Italian-American photojournalist and investigative reporter in the field of extraterrestrial-related phenomena research. She is also a widely published freelance writer, and she's especially known in Europe, but she's getting very well known over here in the United States. She's been doing a lot of good work here for years. She has studied extraterrestrial-related phenomena since 1979 and is on personal terms with many of the leading researchers in the field. From 1980 to 86, she assisted Dr. J. Allen Hynek with his UFO investigations and has interviewed many top military witnesses concerning their involvement in the government truth embargo. In 97, Ms. Harris met and interviewed Colonel Philip Corso in Roswell, New Mexico, and became a personal friend and confidant. She was instrumental in having his book, The Day After Roswell, for which she wrote the preface, translated into Italian. She consequently brought Colonel Corso to Italy, to Corso to, yeah, Corso to Italy for the editorial group Futuro, publisher of the second Giorno, Dopo, Roswell, and Corso was present for many TV appearances and two conferences. Anyway, she's done so much. Her her bio, I invite you listeners to go on to AquarianRadio.com and click on Paula's uh, bio. She has this, uh, a list of credits uh, longer than a football field. I mean, she's just amazing. Um, her books. UFOs, how does one speak to a ball of light? And uh, there's another one that says exopolitics, exopolitics, how does one speak to a ball of light? We'll ask uh, Paula what the differences are. And connecting the dots, making sense of the UFO phenomenon. And let's see, she had one in the book. Exopolitics, all of the above. So we're going to talk to Paula and ask her about these different books and what she covered. And I'm going to navigate over here first. I'm going to say, hi, sweetheart. Hi, Dr. Lesson. What would you like to say before we bring on Paula Harris? Oh, well, I'm looking forward to this uh, conference that, Paula, that you're putting on. Uh, and, and I want to hear about all these great presenters and little uh, uh, nutshells of what they're going to do. That would uh, be a turn. Here you go. One okay, I was, just saying, I was just saying aloha to you people. <laughs> I have to say aloha because that's aloha. hello, yeah. And and uh, thank you for mentioning all the books. There's four of them. The Stargate to a New Reality is the fourth one, but but all, they are all interviews. Uh, the books that I wrote are a way of getting all those interviews out to the general public. So they're military interviews. There's people who have worked in the intelligence community. There's Dr. John Mack, uh, Dr. Hynek, Philip Corso. I mean, all the people that I met. So everything I've done in my career, I'm like Barbara Walters. I just talked to a lot of people uh, with the tape recorder, with you know, with the tape recorder. So it's question and answer, and it's in those four books, which you can get on Amazon. I wonder why that that last book wasn't coming up, but I'll have to look for that afterwards. Um, I was looking for your books to put them on you know, my page here, and uh, when I put in your name, it uh, that what was the last one you mentioned? I'm gonna make a note of it and look at my well, title. Well, it's called um, Exopolitics: Stargate to a New Reality, but it's important because that book has the 1945 San Antonio, New Mexico crash. There's 35 pages of that interview with the two people, and that's a brand new story. So it's Exopolitics, Stargate to a New Reality. Well, I will look that up and add that to the page on Aquarian Radio. And um, I will mention to the end of the show, what is your website for our listeners so they can my my find personal your- uh my personal website the one that's me is www p a o l a harris harris dot com and the starworks uh, conference website is www starworks usa 
dot com. And that is very important. Tell us the dates of this conference and um, who's going to be at it. Maybe that's a, a good place to start. And where? And where? Where? <laughs> and where? Yeah. Where? Well, when, it's, and it's what? Why? <laughs> Okay, well, it's in Laughlin, Nevada, which, you know, that's where we used to have conferences years ago. Laughlin, Nevada is 90 minutes from the Las Vegas airport. It's November 14, 15, and 16 of this year. And uh, it is my Starworks company that's kind of going back there, but we are having Bob Brown as the MC, and he was, as people know, he was the owner of the International UFO Congress way back when uh, and had done 19 years at Laughlin, Nevada. So I I asked Bob Brown to to fly up from Honduras, where he lives now, and what's going to happen is that it'll be old home week. It'll be nostalgia for everybody. Oh, that's exciting. Well, I didn't actually come on until after they they moved it to the um, UFO Congress. I guess uh, did they change the name or anyway? I, no, I no, they it. bought it. Uh, uh, bought, Open uh, Minds bought it. Uh, they bought it. They bought it in two thousand nine, and they're still doing it. You know, they're still going to do it in Phoenix. But uh, since I had done conferences all over the United States under Star Wars. 